Uh, I'm very interested in the project. I think it has a lot of potential. Mm -hmm. uh, the theory behind it is uh, extremely good. What theory? So that if you incorporate a cell in a capsule, deliver that capsule near the site of a tumor, give a prodrug in a smaller dose than what would normally be given. The drug, the prodrug is converted to the active drug at the site. Um, that's, that's the theory behind it all. Ultimately what it involves is incorporating a particular type of cell into um, a capsule that is patented. Uh, it's called cell in a box. Um, the, the type of cell that we're going to incorporate is going to have a particular type of activity that is capable of converting a component of cannabis uh, to an active anti-cancer drug. So what the research involves is um, identifying the type of cell that's capable of doing that. The cell's capable, or would be capable, of converting a pro-drug, an, an inactive compound that can be converted into an active compound that is uh, anti-neoplastic. It, it can destroy the cancer cell. Actual medical marijuana, mm -hmm. I haven't started. What we're using is model compounds that are similar chemically mm -hmm. to the components that we are um, looking for in cannabis. Mm -hmm. So right now we're, we're using the model compounds to screen the cells. We, we are not using marijuana itself. And why don't you use marijuana? We're waiting for uh, approval from the DEA for a Schedule One license. How long does that take? When are you? Do you think you will get it? Uh, we applied. I think mid-May. And my understanding is, if it's going to be rejected, we would have heard by now. So and that doesn't necessarily mean anything, but uh, presumably giving serious consideration. I have a lot of confidence. I have experience since um, the early 70s, mm -hmm. 1970s, uh, with drug metabolism. And I've been working on uh, anti-cancer drugs since the mid-70s. Um, so I, I have experience working with this. Uh, we have some information that the type of activity that we need is located in several types of cells and that's what we're screening. Yeah.